so in this lecture we'll see that how to define the member functions outside the class so we'll just take the previous example we'll just okay and we'll just define the data members the data members are string name and int roll number these are the private data members and in the public section we'll just declare the member functions so the first member function is get data and the second member function is void display right so here we are just we are just declaring okay so we are just declaring the member functions so now our task is to define these member functions outside the class in the previous example what we have done we have just defined the get data and the display inside this class but now we will define it outside the class so let's see how we will define it so the first thing that you have to remember is you have to provide the return type of the member function okay so taking the get data member function the return type is void it should be followed by the class name that is student followed by a special operator okay that contains a pair of okay colons and this operator is known as scope resolution operator in c++ that is very important followed by the name of the function okay so in this way this function can be defined outside the class so if i just write class followed by this okay so this student followed by this scope resolution operator is known as membership label okay so this is known as membership label okay the class name followed by the scope resolution operator is known as membership label okay and this operator is known as scope resolution operator okay so this operator is known as scope resolution operator in c++ and class followed by this scope resolution operator is also known as membership label so what the statement means that this get data okay that this get data is a member of this student so this scope resolution operator is providing the scope to this get data member function telling that this the scope of this get data is this class student it is a part of this class it is a member of this class and the return type of this get data is void so this is the meaning of this particular statement so here we'll just write c out enter the name and we'll just read it with the help of get line as we have done okay earlier get line followed by scene and the name in which we want to read the string c out okay roll number and we'll just read the roll number as c in r o l l so this task has been completed of reading the data so now the main task is to display this data so again we create a function outside the class that is the display function so we'll just write void the name of the class that is student okay followed by the membership okay scope resolution operator and together this is known as membership label followed by the name of the function that is display so now here we have to just display the contents so we'll just write c out okay slash n name is and we'll just give a tab and we'll just write name and c out slash n roll number is we'll just give a tab and we'll write this is an error okay so here we'll just write roll so in this way the function definition outside the class has been completed okay. so you have to follow two things 
first the first statement should be the return type followed by the name of the class followed by the scope resolution operator okay class followed by scope resolution operator is known as membership label and then we have to write the name of the function and then we have to write the logic so now what we have to do the main task is to create a main so we'll just create a main okay so i'll just write int main and inside this what we have to do we have to create an object of a class the class is student the object is st so now we'll just call the member functions with the help of this object so the first mem member function is get data and the second member function is display okay so in this way okay we will call the member functions with the help of the object so let's try to compile this code and let's see what is the output so it has successfully okay compiled so if i give the name as ajay and roll number as 50 so the output is you can see the name is ajay and roll number is 50 so in this way we can okay we can process the results by defining the member function outside the class with the help of scope resolution operator now i hope it is clear to you thanks